Welcome to my day one highlights uh, from the Atomic Brim Qualifier on the Hawkesbury River recently. Now, uh, it was such a nasty day on practice, I didn't go out practicing at all for this event. I uh, just went straight into the tournament and fished my favourite boats at Palm Beach for a start, using, of course, the uh, trusty heavy cranker crab to help deal with those heavy wind conditions. The water was a little bit roiled up at the start, but we still picked up a few fish off these boats. It was uh, pretty heavily pressured at the start, four or five boats pulled in at the same but uh, I had to work out the pattern for the day. This is where I started. There you go. Thanks, man. Well done. Thank you. Yeah. Now, did the first one? I don't know, probably just go legal. He's not a not a giant, but throw back in there, mate. There's only still of them in there. Probably one of the smallest fish I've caught in this part of the world. Number one. After that, I moved into Kareel Bay, and well, this story tells itself. You fish on the sander down there. Oh, not very big, I think it's not a brim. I think it's a snapper or something. My non-boater for the day was ABT debutant Kevin Lynn and he had a great time on the boat and he hadn't even caught a fish yet. Well done man, thank you very much. <laughs> Not giants, but they'll do. Each fish I was entering into the ABT tournament series app so the people that were watching the live stream knew what I had in the well. Since I didn't practice and refine down exactly where the fish were, I threw a few casts towards the bank and this fish came from a little bit of rocky shorelines with some, uh, with some boats moored on it. Fish. That could be a better one. Yep, look at him. You can see him a long way out. Shake your head, buddy. He was in closer, that one. Just let him tire out. we got plenty of time. You know, oh, he's just shaking his head because he's got it stuck in him. So, so we get him to the surface. He might start fighting that. He's close to the butt. All right, there we go. Thank you very much. Number three. But in winter time when they get in here, there's often, if you catch one, there's a school of them, so hopefully we can find a few here. In calmer water, I reverted to my favourite 40 mil TMCO stick minnow, because I think that's an even more finesse presentation on the two pound line. Oh, it came out. <laughs> I don't think it was that big, I saw him. Didn't bend the hook out or anything. But I think there was more than one there, so. That's a stick minnow, yeah, yeah. So that's a stick minnow, and that was seen. It ate, it ate that before it got to the bottom, which means there's usually more than one fish, so. Throw your little Z-Man in there as well. You can see the fish on the sand in here now. You want to miss, mate? Yep, yep. It's actually a little bit bigger than the last one. Look at the one behind him too. Thank you, sir. <laughs> nice. Oh, there's the thick minnow coming in. It's got no barbs on it, that hook, so. Throw straight down. There's, they're under the boat here now. You can see them. That yep, that's one. This is a better one. So I'll just take your time with him. Oh, look at them all following him. There's a thousand following him. No, he's not that big actually, but. Oops, Thanks, mate. Hey. Right, thank you all. Yeah, it's been good to me that one over the years. Used to be a boat that turned into a pontoon. Oh, I've been, been fishing this spot for over 10 years, I reckon, now, so. With five in the well from my known spots, it was now time to read the conditions and go pre fishing for the next day, basically. And uh, this fish came off a spot I'd never fished before in pit water. One. Feels better.
Yeah, 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 yeah. Good one. Let this one tire himself out. He's gonna be. He's a proper one. This one. In clear water and on two pounds straight through fluorocarbon, there's no reason to rush these fish to the net. Yeah, it's a proper one. Slowly his head breaks the surface. Boom! Oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's your problem, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Look how big that is! It's a big one. Oh, my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> it's not giant, but it'll do. Long way to work for a bite. That was funny. That's the only... It's not a boat, it's a pontoon, and there was a fish under the pontoon, not the boat, so... That's what you want, you want five of those from in here, then you're going to win a tournament. After that upgrade, we worked our way back towards the start, which is in the background over there. I don't think it's that... I don't think it's... Nah, it's not that big. Uh, it's got a little head shake. I mean, it's bigger than I thought. Nice, nice one. I don't know. Oh, that's alright, might be enough. Yep, yeah, it's a brim. Could be an upgrade. Could be an upgrade, yep. Thank you, sir. It is an upgrade. <laughs> there you go, you get a few more casts now. Thank you. Got him. Thank you. That was handy. Handy little last minute upgrade.